So Hannah, we've just finished our final session here in Ireland. How would you reflect on it as a week? It's been a really good week, a really tough week. Um, it's a long time to have the players away from their families, um, but they've all applied themselves really, really well, worked really hard. Um, I think it's bonded them as a group um, and we've made some real gains both on and off the pitch. And what were you looking, you know, at the start of the week coming in, what, what were you looking for from the week as a whole? Uh, obviously, we're looking after the team for, for this period, so we had some um, basic sort of tactical objectives that we were trying to get out of the week for them, for their understanding. Um, obviously, physical returns are really, really key, um, with us now being three weeks away from the start of the season today. Um, and also social returns in terms of just the camaraderie and the, and the group as a whole in terms of them getting closer and wanting to work for each other and wanting to fight for, for, for the, each other and for the football club. We had one behind closed doors game, didn't we, on Tuesday, which ended in a 2-0 in a win. What were your reflections on that game against UCD? Yeah, it was a really good exercise. Um, lovely facility, obviously, um, and a good opposition. Um, and it was, we got a lot out of the game in terms of some of the things we've been trying to work on as I get, again, going, getting more minutes in the players' legs and looking at different combinations of players working together. And I suppose for, for yourself, Hannah, since last Wednesday coming in against Melksham, what have you been trying to bring to the group? Is it a sense of almost continuity, not trying to change almost too much? The biggest thing for me is to try to get those players smiling again. You know, it's been a, it's been a tough old last season. Obviously, a lot changed this season. We've got a really talented group of footballers at this club um, who maybe haven't shown the best of themselves um, in recent times. And a couple of new faces have arrived during the week. What's it been like having Geordie back and Luke Daniels has had a session or two as well, hasn't he? Oh, it's great to have Geordie back in the group. Obviously, he's you know, been with us, been at the club for a while. Um, he's a great personality to have around the group. Um, same with Luke, obviously a very experienced player which automatically brings a lift to the group um, at that bit of security and that sort of defensive position. So it's been great to have them on board and fantastic that they've been able to come and join us out here for that sort of um, team building element of getting to know each other. and make So when they come back to England and ready for training, they'll be obviously tip top in a good position to impress the new head coach. And training next week and it's going to be a, a busy week, isn't it, as well? Because there's three games in, in five days against good opposition. Yes, yeah, it's an exciting week. It's always great to play play games that's what everybody wants to, to do and it'd be great for the fans to see some of the, you know, the players coming back in um, I think the commentary game is going to be really tough um, and it'll be a real good test to see how, how well the boys have taken on the information and, and what physical shape they're in in terms of that, that game and then the Wednesday game against Everton um, will be a different proposition in terms of a sort of under 21 side um, but again it's still another great opportunity for players to get minutes in their legs as to start building those relationships and start getting those basic team principles into them. And just finally Hannah I think just a couple of thank yous obviously here at the Saints Arena this week at the Tower Hotel in, in Waterford as well some really good facilities this week I think. Yeah we've been really well looked after um, at, the, at the as you say at the hotel at the um, also here at the Setu Arena um, and I also want to you know put on record my thanks to as well as the players but the staff who've been out with us this week again for everybody you know it's a, it's a, it's a week away from their families you know it's, it's a week in it probably quite difficult circumstances and I think Everybody as a group of players and staff have applied themselves and put it really, really well and got a really good positive week, um, which is down to everyone's hard work and I really appreciate that and as a club we should do too.